Hello everyone, John Tabor from UDS. I recently had a conversation with an F&I manager who emailed me to ask how she could get her enthusiasm for her job back. She shared with me that she had a couple of tough months and she wasn't as excited about her job as she had been in the past. She wanted to know if I had any tips to get her back on track, so I gave her a call. I asked her to describe a typical day for me. After just a couple of minutes, I could see that she was reacting to her day and she seemed to be waiting more than she was taking action. I suggested to her that it might be beneficial if she take more control of her day. That sounded good to her, so we worked out a daily task list for her to work from. By listing some important tasks that we could agree she could do every day, she'd be reestablishing a productive routine, get her back in control of her day, and maybe get her back on track. Today I thought I'd share some of the things that were on her list. First, walk in through the service door and check for opportunities with the service writers and maybe some of the customers. Secondly, she said she was going to participate in the Save a Deal meeting every day. She vowed to get these meetings happening and bring accountability to every sales opportunity from the day before and determine what is happening today and assign or reassign tasks for completion of what needed to be done. Then she told me she wanted to make sure she logged and closed out any pending deals, checking for accuracy and compliance before they go to accounting. She wanted to review her monthly goals and where she was to plan. She wanted to participate in the sales meeting. She said she would take a couple of minutes to train and teach. Whether it was about F&I or sales in general, she wanted to show some leadership. She wanted to check in with her GM or director, advise on month-to-day progress versus goal, and inform them of any issues if they're being handled. Sales staff check in, find out about working deals, today's appointments, ask how she can help, and maybe look for opportunities to close a deal or two. Accounting check in, she wanted to check in on CITs and see if there was anything she could do to help accounting run a little more smoothly. Work on lender relations, check the accuracy of her programs, and be sure to call back any rehashes first thing in the morning. She wanted to walk the inventory. Proper deal structure begins with the right vehicle. So she said she was going to shake hands with the inventory every day. And then finally, check supplies and straighten up her office. Now these are just 10 things on the list we came up with for her to start doing every day. Your list may be different. Either way, the activity of this new routine will result in more energy for her and maybe an opportunity or two for the dealership. What can we learn from her? We can learn that. We should establish a daily routine and stick to it. If you do, like her, maybe you'll have more energy and more enthusiasm for your job and who knows, you might find a deal or two as well. That's your tip of the week. For a transcript, email me at jtabor at udsdealerservices.com or if you'd like to join our free newsletter.